Hello and welcome to all. In this video, we will learn about chart of accounts in SAP. But before we start, if you have not yet subscribed to our My Support Solutions YouTube channel, then click on the subscribe button. Also, don't forget to click on the bell icon so that you will get the latest updates after every new video upload. This is totally free. Please like and share this video. Share the knowledge. Sharing is caring. Now let us start. So in this video, we will learn about chart of accounts in SAP. So there are three chart of accounts. First is operative chart of account. Second is group chart of account. And third is country specific chart of accounts. So first operative chart of account is a mandatory chart of account. This type of chart of account, this type of chart of account is mandatory to maintain. It is used to record daily transactions, day to day transactions. Second is group chart of account. This is optional. We use this group chart of account for consolidation purpose. For example, our company is ABC Group uh, and ABC Infotech, ABC Pharma and ABC Steel. These are our company codes. Then suppose if we want to a consolidated report for our, our these company codes, then we can use a group chart of account. This chart of account is optional. Then country specific chart of account. Again, this type of chart of account is also optional. If our company is operating in different countries, then we can use country specific chart of accounts. So these are the three types of chart of accounts. First is optional. Second is group chart of account and third is country specific chart of accounts. Now we will do practicals and here I will put SPRO press enter click on the IMG button financial accounting general ledger accounting GL accounts master data preparations and edit chart of account list okay so I will click on this then click on the new entries button here we have to put our chart of accounts code so here I will put suppose 39 let's say 3900 ABC limited chart of account maintain language in general specifications we have to maintain the language language key is English in English now this is a length of GL account number see the length of GL account number is allowed from 1 to 9 if we put here 1 then system will allow us to create only 9 GLs if we put 2 then System will allow us to create 99 GLs. If we put here 3, then system will allow us to create a triple 9 GL. This is the logic behind it. Okay, here we put the number as per our requirement. So here I will put the 7 number. Length of GL account number is 7. Means we will able to create, see, if we put 7 number over here, then system will allow us to create a GL three four five six seven this number of general ledgers this number of general ledgers system will allow us to create if we put here seven number I will again explain you if we put here one then see system will allow us to create only nine GLs okay if we put here two then system will allow us see if here we put uh, two numbers, then system will allow us to create 99 GLs like that. So here I will put a 7. This is based on our requirement. Then controlling integration. Right now I will select manual creation of cost element. We can, uh, there are two options, manual creation of cost element and automatic creation of cost table. 
automatic creation of cost element right now i will select manual creation of cost element here i will not maintain any group chart of accounts and uh, then i will save the record so yes continue data was saved so take back then we will check our chart of account so this is our 3900 abc limited chart of accounts okay so that's all for now in this video if you have any queries or suggestions regarding this video please feel free to comment and uh, again thanks for watching this video keep in touch and bye bye